What's up, y'all? King Carlos here. Just something I want to talk about real quick, bro. It ain't got to be a long video. Just to keep y'all informed on something, bro. Um, which I think a lot of people already know. You know what I'm saying? People that's not in the blind, but the people that's not in the, the people that's people that's not in the blind, but people obviously blind have no idea what I'm about to talk about. Um, stop freaking out over this mask shit, man. You know, if you gotta go in somewhere and make you wear masks, just put one on. And and, and this is nothing to me warn y'all, bro. My brother's watching that shit. The mask shit is not for the world. They told the mask shit is for white people, bro. It's to get white people under pressure to make white people follow rules because they never have. It's to put them in a state of arrest and civil unrest, which is doing. But you see them getting very angry and upset, irate, um, freaking out very badly, uh, not being calm or not listening to logic or reason. Just being very angry, um, going off on everybody, you know. It's crazy. It, all these stores have signs on them that says, put a mask on for you come inside, but people still walking in, going off on everybody. You see? And all, all that is, bro, is to further. It's just like Black Lives Matter. It wasn't put here to um, to to help black people. It was put here to further isolate white people from the rest of society and make every race hate them. That's what all these, these patronizing videos are. When you see all these videos of the Karens and shit like that. They've been planning that shit for about 60 years, bro, how to take down America. And they knew the hardest people to take down in America were white people. But the way to take them down is to force. But but if, if you force every race to hate them, it's easy because now they got to worry about every, every everywhere they go. Then they see somebody not white, they getting stared at, me mugged. Everybody's looking at the crazy. Everybody's looking for somebody white to freak out every time they see them in a the corner store. Everybody's looking for somebody white to freak out every time they see them um, in public. Period, bro. When they see them going inside of a uh, a Walmart, when they see these white people in banks, people are now every race is looking for white people now to freak out. Same when they kind of used to blacks kind of wild out, you know, and say uh, scream racial screen racial shit now. Now they look for white people to yell some, call somebody a nigger. They look for white people to tell somebody to go back to their country. You know what I'm saying? That's all it is. And the mask shit is just to further it because everybody follows the rules but white people. And that's been like that. But it's always benefited white people to not follow the rules because the democracy and, um, forgive me, for, because democracy and the constitution was written to protect them. And if they didn't want to follow the rules, they didn't have to. That's called white privilege. But now white privilege is almost demonizing because I mean it's almost helping demonize them more because they can't naturally stop using it because it just how could you stop using privilege? They don't even know they're using it. They don't even know they're doing it. They just doing whatever they want and they've always been given the right to do that. So how are you gonna just automatically tell them one day that they can't do what they want? You see, it's not designed that it's designed to let them keep doing that, but to kind of put a, a, a magnifying glass on them. Like look at everybody following the rules but these white people. Look at everybody, look at everybody being calm, but white people are killing people. Look at everybody, um, Look at the police murdering everybody, but white people want to defend the police. That's all that is, bro. It's just to further demonize white people so they can um, put that agenda off. That's all that shit is, my nigga. That's all that is, bro, I swear. You can kind of see it. You don't see how they kind of making white people that, like, and everybody knows that. I'm not saying, you know, whenever you look up, like, a, you watch a damn movie about Indians, you watch a movie about slaves, you can watch a movie about um, another fucking plant. You can watch a movie about the U.S. government doing something to people. They're all white. You can watch a movie about, um, we already know the damn race movies and all the old neo-Nazi movies and shit, but they're starting to bring that same shit back if y'all notice, bro. All that is to demonize white people. That's all that is, dog. It's to help demonize white people even more so when they do start killing the people and they do, because see, see, white people even thinking now that the government's going to pull a kill order out to kill minorities. The kill order out is gonna, the kill order's going to be for minorities to, for everybody to finally attack white people. See, white people have been attacking everybody this whole time, freaking out where everybody is doing the best they can, holding on, trying to scrap up food. Um, you know, jobs are kind of coming back on, but people are still being very neglected to hire. The, the unemployment rate is still very bad in America. You know what I'm saying? But you still see white people freaking out. Everybody doing the best they can, but white people just freaking out, right? Hurting people. That's all that is, bro. All that magnifying glasses, those videos you're seeing, that's the, that's, so whenever they, it's reversed. Whenever they want to do something to white people, they put blacks in the forefront to make white people comfortable. All the time, remember that, bro. That's, that's part of the government's tactics. And it works really good. It's working right now. See, first off, they said came from China. The coronavirus came from China, which we know it did. It came from China, right? And then they said black people are the most likely to get it. Then they said Hispanic people are the most likely to spread it. All that is, bro, is to take that to to take the focus off my off white people. Well, to put the focus on white people, but to take to, to put the pressure on white people by other voices, but to make them think that the government is still on their side, which is not. It's hel it's helping demonize them. But they stupid. They don't realize that. This is like Donald Trump. Donald Trump was put here to help demonize white people, not save them, dog. 
He wasn't put here to um, all that that race shit he does. It puts a flag. It puts a fucking ding dot on your head. Like when you go out there and wear a, wear a Nazi shirt and you go back to your apartment, people in your apartment complex, everybody's not black. Some people Mexican. They still watch you. They know where you live. Now they know where your family lives. They know you got two daughters. They know you got a son. You come out with your guns, so they know what kind of guns you got. That's all that is, bro. Remember that shit. These niggas stupid.